hello there welcome to my channel 1m90 and uh, this is Amit so in this video basically I'll be uh, telling you about the Cantonese language support in uh, Google input tools so before I begin with uh, let me tell you something about Cantonese language uh, so Cantonese language does not have a widely used romanization standards so but with the help of Google input tools which supports the Cantonese IME what we simply need to know is how we think the word sounds in English and type in those words you know as they sound in English so when we do this what happens is the Google IME will attempt to find out the words that match those sounds which we key in so this is something called as a phonetic transliteration so the transliteration will be happening from English to Cantonese so to begin with uh, so this was a brief uh, background about the Cantonese uh, language uh, so to begin with uh, I would let, let us search for uh, uh, the Google input tools extension from Chrome uh, so basically what it does is it enables the uh, the way we it enables the IME so that you know we respond back to the respondents using the Cantonese language so uh, on the every web page that is opened up in Chrome so let me search for uh, Google input tools Chrome extension so here you go so this is the result from Google chrome.google.com so let's open that up so let us add this to Chrome so say add extension so it's installing it's checking the prerequisites first it downloads and checks the prerequisites and then uh, it's add that extension to the chrome so you can see a success window here a success pop-up which says google input tools has been added to chrome so that's great so let us close this so now what we are supposed to do is we need to go to the keyboard shortcut settings oh sorry we need to go to the extension options so you see that there are numerous language that are supported in this particular google input tool so what we are targeted into is the Cantonese so scroll through and select the uh, Chinese traditional Taiwan and add it to the selected input tools so I also select another language say Hindi so that I demonstrate uh, how do we context switch between these two languages so with Google input tools we can also you know context switch between the input tools between the input languages so let me close this now so uh, let us see how do we use it so uh, today is my mom's birthday uh, so I would like to wish her a happy birthday mommy in uh, Cantonese so let me see how do we do that so now any nothing is selected I mean you have not selected any input tool input language so in order to do that click on this icon over here and say click on the Chinese traditional so you see a little uh, toolbar that appeared over here beside the input so what I type is I'll wish her a happy birthday mommy Mommy, Sangya, Philo, Mommy, Sangya, Philo. So this is the one you select. So 
double click on that and yo so you just typed in a Cantonese I mean you just wished I mean I just wish my mom in Cantonese language so this is how you use Google input tools to type in your desired language suppose if I would like to switch between languages say now I would like to wish my mom in Hindi so I would contact switch between the languages like this I'll say Janam Din Ki Moba Rak So I need to sound but right Mubarak right this is here so this is how you key in the Cantonese English and you can also context switch between the languages I guess hope you enjoyed this video and uh, hope the concepts were clear so let me know in case you have any questions clarifications that you know while installing the Chrome extension etc so I would be happy to help you and uh, please do subscribe to our channel for more updates stay tuned for the other updates and videos please don't forget to share like and subscribe us thanks a lot for watching